Summary Captain Carrie Tytheradge is easygoing and approachable, dealing with issues on the superyacht in a straightforward manner. Chef Anthony Irikane has a positive disposition, despite struggling with timeliness, making impeccable meals on the Saint. David, deckhand Kyle Stilley brings a positive, laid-back attitude to the crew, helping out and remaining calm in all situations. Below Deck Season 11 has introduced some of the most interesting crewmates to the Saint. David, but which of the yachties has the worst attitude when it comes to their life aboard the ship? While the standard below deck crew typically changes from season to season, there are some familiar faces aboard the Saint. David on the current season. With a mix of new and old yachties aboard, there have already been rising tensions for the crew as they've gotten into the first charters of the season, helping guests and doing their best to work together as a cohesive unit. Although there are some below-deck faces that have been introduced in seasons and series prior, like Captain Carrie Tytheradge and Chief Stu Fraser Allender, there are more new faces aboard the Saint. David than familiar ones. This is typical of below-deck, as is the fact that many of the crew aboard the Saint. David have a bit of attitude about what they do on the ship. While some of the crew are newer to the yachting industry, others have been part of it for years and bring their own specialized knowledge into their jobs, causing some personality clashes. Related 20 best reality TV shows right now television is being impacted by the ongoing entertainment industry strikes, leaving many turning to reality TV. What are the best shows right now? 10 Carry Tither Edge Captain Close, Below Deck Below Deck is a popular reality TV franchise that focuses on a group of crew members as they work on luxurious yachts and cater to their clients' needs. After the original series proved to be a success, Bravo developed a handful of spin-off shows including Below Deck Selling Yacht, Below Deck Adventure, Below Deck Down Under, and Below Deck Mediterranean. As the captain of the Saint David, Carrie Tytheradge has a huge amount of responsibility aboard the superyacht. From navigating the ship to dealing with the crew and charter guests, Captain Carrie has his work cut out for him, which makes it impossible for him to have much of an attitude. Typically, Captain Carey is easygoing and straightforward, as he has been in his other appearances on the Below Deck franchise. Though Captain Carey can have difficult moments with the crew that cause tension, he's typically the most approachable person aboard the vessel. 9. Anthony Irikane Chef While he's new to the Saint David, Chef Anthony Irikane is one of the more amiable people on the superyacht's crew. Though Anthony has only been shown in a few moments throughout the season thus far, the new Below Deck Season 11 Chef has been shown to have less of an attitude than some of the other crew members working on the ship. Though Chef Anthony has been struggling with his timeliness, his meals have been impeccable and his perfectionism doesn't equate to having a poor attitude. Overall, Anthony's disposition has been one of the best aboard the St. David. 8. Kyle Stilly Deckhand Deckhand Kyle Stilly, who is originally from Scotland, may not have a lot of experience in the yachting world, but he's proven to be an asset aboard the St. David, with just a year of experience under his belt, Kyle has been helpful to the team working the exterior and has shown that he's not afraid to get to work when he needs to. Kyle's attitude aboard the vessel has been notable for being more positive than others, who are simply looking for control. Laid back and easygoing, Kyle has been a calming presence on the ship. 7. Marie, Sonny, Marquis Deckhand Another Deckhand, Marie, Sonny, 
Marquis has been dealing with her issues aboard the Saint. David in an interesting way. Though she has a positive outlook, her attitude is a bit more stoic than some of the other crew members aboard the Saint. David, while she's been pursuing aboatments with below-deck returning crew member Ben Willoughby, Sunny's outlook has been more easygoing than some of the other women on the ship. Still, things with Sunny have been somewhat more difficult than with other crew members, as her interpersonal issues have colored her working experience. 6. Fraser Allender Chief Stu Close, as the Chief Stu aboard the St. David, Fraser is one of the familiar faces on the Supriot for viewers. Fraser, who has moved from a steward to the Chief's 2, has made it clear that he's not interested in big drama on Below Deck Season 11. Despite the fact that he's causing drama of his own throughout his relationship with his stews, Fraser believes he's keeping things casual. While his attitude isn't the worst aboard the St. David, Fraser has been stubborn throughout his time on Below Deck Season 11, which gives him more of a negative attitude. 5. Barbie Pasquale Third Stu Although she's one of the best stews on Below Deck Season 11 and works hard to ensure that her job is done as well as possible, Barbie Pasquale has been giving major attitude in her time on The Saint. David Barbie, who is used to working more independently than she does on the vessel, has been struggling with teamwork on the ship. Though Barbie knows she can get things done alone, it's clear that the attitude she has makes it impossible for some to work with her. Overall, she doesn't have the worst attitude, but doesn't have the best, either. 4. Zandi Olivier Second Stu as Chief Stu Fraser's second in command, Sandy Olivier has been promoted aboard the Saint. David, but her attitude on the super yacht leaves a lot to be desired. While Zandi isn't openly rude to her colleagues or her guests, she's made it clear she doesn't want to interact with anybody if she can help it. Zandi often takes the work on the interior seriously, taking care of bed and heads whenever she can. Rather than dealing with service, Zandi's poor attitude makes it clear she wants to stay away from being social. 3. Jared Wooden Boson Close, although he seems to have decent reasons for the issues he's facing aboard the Saint. David, Jared Wooden has been struggling to find his footing as the ship's boson since his earliest days aboard the vessel. Making some serious mistakes that have caused Captain Carey to keep an eye on him, Jared has been struggling with interpersonal issues along with issues in his job. While he hasn't let the stress overtake him yet, it appears that Jared's poor attitude could push him to quit below deck season 11 sooner rather than later. 2. Ben Willoughby lead deckhand after appearances on below deck in the past, Ben has been struggling to find his footing aboard the Saint. David, though he's working well as the new lead deckhand on the vessel, he's also been having a hard time speaking up about his responsibilities on the ship. Blaming others for mistakes and calling people out over public radio lines, Ben has made some of his other colleagues uncomfortable. His attitude throughout the charter season has been difficult to watch, but it's possible he'll make a comeback and get back into the captain's good graces. 1. Cat Ba Fourth Stu While she's one of the stews that Fraser is giving a major chance to, Cat Ba has had some serious emotional issues while on the ship. After dealing with her feud with Barbie, Kat has struggled to find herself worthy of spending time with the rest of the Below Deck Season 11 cast. 
While she's confronted the behavior head-on, it's possible she simply needs to adjust her attitude moving forward so her colleagues can read her a bit more easily. Below Deck airs Mondays on Bravo at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time.